Thanks, Doug. I'm happy to be here. I'm thrilled to get a chance to share a little bit of our story of transformation with you about Avis Budget Group. So a bit about us. We're a global leader in mobility services, operating in more than 180 countries worldwide. You'll likely recognize some of our brands, Avis and Budget for car and truck rental, and Zipcar, the world's largest car sharing network. We offer a range of different services to bring vehicles closer to where our customers need them and when. Whether it's by the minute or by the hour, whether it's a one-way trip, a weekly or a month long. Now, a couple of years ago, like many of you, I'm sure, we started to see a dramatic shift in consumer preferences. More to on-demand services, more to access of a vehicle versus ownership, to mobile-first applications. And what we found was our customers not only expect, but they're more demanding personalization and transparency, right? So we knew that we had to innovate our technology platform to be able to meet these customers where they were now, but also to be agile enough to meet the needs of tomorrow's customers. And so about two years ago, it's factored into our decision to fundamentally transform our company. Now, we're a legacy company, all right? So as one that's been in business for more than 70 years, as you can imagine, we've invested in legacy technology. But we've run a very successful business. And to put it in perspective, we have more than 600,000 cars globally that we operate. And really what that means is it adds up to more than $18 billion. We, in addition to the customer preferences that we saw changing, the other thing that we really saw was a massive change in the marketplace with aggressive new competitors in mobility. And we knew that we didn't have the luxury to sit around and wait and evolve. We knew we needed to transform. We knew we needed to do it now, and we needed to do it right. So we knew we needed both the technology platform as well as partners to help us on our journey. Enter Amazon Web Services. So we saw our move to AWS not as much as a lift and shift, but rather as a way to remove barriers, to allow us to pave a road to innovate. And now AWS is home for many of the critical components of our mobility platform, including our connected vehicle solution, which powers our global telematics hub. This is where we bring vehicle data from across our fleet, different make model years into a single environment. And this lets us make decisions now in almost real time. We added real time analytics in AWS using SageMaker and Lambda for serverless compute. And we designed and built our advanced data and our entire BI platform, also in AWS, which features our global enterprise data lake, our real time data warehouse, and our visualization tools, leveraging AWS tech like Redshift and EMR. Now, this sounds really cool, right? Sounds cool, but so what? What does that mean? Let me tell you. For the first time ever, our cars are talking to us. So what does that mean? Well, before this, you can imagine, before AWS, at a given lot, an Avis employee would have to manually check every single tire for tire pressure before those vehicles could go out on rent. Now our cars tell us if they need air. And they'll tell us which tire needs attention. And they'll even tell us where they are in the lot. Sounds small, you can imagine. But now look at this across 2.4 million tires in our fleet. And you can imagine some of the efficiencies that we would gain. In addition, now when cars are returned and they get scanned in, we make an API call real time to AWS Analytics to determine what we do with the vehicle next. Whether we're going to get that car out immediately for rent or whether we're going to park it in a back lot. And this has allowed us to learn and change on the fly, but also keep the agent's experience simple. Now, when it comes to innovation, it is about partnerships as well. We couldn't have done this without help. Partners that we've integrated with that have provided new services to our customers that we don't have. Partners that we've integrated with that provide new lines of business and new revenue that we never would have had. APN technology partners that we've leveraged for the software and the services that are all running in our environment. And APN consulting partners 
that have helped us to design and implement all of this solution. By taking advantage of this partner ecosystem, we've been able to hit the ground running immediately, but also take advantage of all this great emerging tech that's going on. We're able to move fast, which we know we needed. Now, let me give some examples of how partners helped us on our journey. We chose Slalom to help us set up our real-time analytics environment in SageMaker. And what was great is they brought expertise we didn't have in-house in both the technology as well as in data science. And Slalom teamed up with TCS to help design and implement all of the components of our connected vehicle solution. TCS was also instrumental in helping us to rewrite and migrate a mission-critical mainframe application that delivers up-to-the-minute car rental rates to third-party travel sites as well. So all in all, our investment in innovation in our platform has benefited us financially immediately. We've seen benefits in cost through savings and operations, and we've seen an increase in revenue by driving up customer satisfaction, as well as by opening up avenues to new lines of business that we didn't have. For example, our connected cars can now report fuel to us within one-tenth of a gallon. And what that means is that now we're able to recoup more than $1 of what would have been otherwise lost fuel per transaction. And so you can imagine at 167 million rental days, that does add up really quickly. Also, you know, when you have a fleet of more than 600,000 vehicles, it does happen occasionally that one of the cars may not be where you think it's going to be. And before AWS, we had limited means to be able to locate a vehicle and to be able to recover it. And now, the cars tell us exactly where they are. And so this has allowed us to take our average recovery time for a vehicle from 20 plus days down to two. Now, the benefits don't stop at just financial. I'm super thrilled to see that we've increased our overall customer satisfaction tremendously. And I'm also really excited to share with you guys that our Avis mobile app was just awarded the best mobile travel application by J.D. Power. Thank you. Thank you. We're thrilled. Yeah. This has also opened up avenues for new revenue for us to use our connected car data. So whether it's through fleet management as a service where we offer the same platform that powers our fleet to other fleet owners, or whether it's through our Data for Good initiative where we team up with cities and municipalities to fight things like congestion and traffic, or whether it's through our newly launched developer program. So what is next for Avis Budget Group? Well, we see ourselves leading a mobility ecosystem, one where all the connected cars come together with smart cities and other partners, and we bring new services and a whole new experience to our customers. But that's just the beginning. We're not at the end of the yellow brick road. We just got on it. It's time to be fearless. And it's time for us to build our own roads and pave a new future together. We couldn't be more excited about the future of mobility, of about the role we get to play in it, about all the collaboration we've had with AWS partners and with AWS itself. Thank you guys very much. <laughs>